You are about to listen to an exclusive interview on Maximum Threshold Radio. Thanks for listening to us at MaximumThreshold.net. Horns up, fists in the air. Hey, this is Dominic, and here we're here live, rocking the range with American Fang. So we're going to get a couple guys here from the band here. Just going to shoot the shit here for a second and just talk about um, what the hell happened to them, you know, recently. Uh, hey, what's up, guys? This is Kyle from the American Fangs, and we recently. Oh, go ahead. All right, you go ahead. No, you take you. the reins on this. No, it's all you, man. It's your story, dude. <laughs> this is Nick, and I got a black eye. How the hell did you get the black eye? Man, there's a lot of rumor going around in this media tent here. Oh, the the big the big story is uh, lacrosse is full of vampires uh, who like to fight. So uh, we took one down uh, as, as a group. Took him down. Uh, I got a black eye out of it, but I'm pretty sure he's got some broken ribs and a little bit of jail time. You look like you got your ass whipped. It <laughs> looks like I got. It yeah. doesn't look like it, man, but it you looks, did. But he's so much worse than me. But I'm a buck 50. He's like 250. So you got me once. He got me once. That's it. So what caused it all? Oh, he was actually breaking into our tour mates uh, Hollywood and Dead's bus. So, I mean, them being our good friends, we weren't just going to sit back. You sure there wasn't Deuce coming back for revenge? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> <laughs> he sent the vampire out to, yeah, ruin their tour bus. No. Yeah. No. So we can just sit back and let that happen. We got to at least say something. And then it just snowballed into me having a black eye. Yeah. So I, got, so I got a quick question here. When you guys are, you know, your music is starting to pick up steam and stuff, um, and you guys got a single that's out there. You want to talk about how that makes you guys feel that your song is finally getting out there so pe- people can check it out? It's crazy, man, because we want people to see how we dance finally. We've been a band for a, quite a while now, but we're just now reestablishing the band name. We've been on plenty of tours before, and, and now that we have the, the single out, the music video for Pomona, we're just, you know, it's just snowballing, you know, everything. Thing is just kind of coming coming up again, and we're I got I got I got your CD right here. I got the single on. Awesome, man! Song. Awesome. I'll check this out for sure. Awesome. For the camera, even though you stream is really messed up today. <laughs> no worries. <laughs> It's going, yeah, it's going nuts. So what do you guys got planned like, for the summer? Uh, hopefully uh, some more tours. Uh, we're, we haven't confirmed anything quite yet. I think we confirmed one tour in the fall. But uh, Later this fall, we're going to be going out with Story of the Year for their 10-year uh, anniversary of their first record, Page Avenue. And uh, next month in June and July, we're going to be going out with a band called Middle Class Rut. Oh, nice. Yeah, so I think that'll be really good. For- yeah, those are two bands, man, who are really... You know they 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 reach that pinnacle to a point, and but but to get on the road with them, man, I, mean, I think it'd be cool for you guys to pick up some new fans and stuff, and really get your word of your music out. It's definitely. Uh, and we also we have a festival back home where we're from, the Free Press Summerfest, which is taking place June first and second, and then uh, I think we're also opening up for Fall Out Boy in our hometown as well. So that's what something else we're looking forward to. A lot of, you're gonna end up with a lot of the older chicks at that show now. Yeah, I hope so. Now they're now they're of age. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. <laughs> so is there anything you want to tell your fans out there? Or new fans? Why you want to bring them into your camp? Let's hang out. That's what we want to say. Let's all hang out. I grew up hanging out with bands after and before shows, and that's kind of gone away. And man, we're bringing that back. We just want to hang out. Come to our come to our show, and you will hang out with us. Nice. We'll make it happen. And it's free. There's no cattle line where we're not looking you in the eye and signing your poster and pushing you out of the door. Our posters are free. Our signatures are free. We're normal. Normal people, just like you, and we want to hang out with you. Yeah. Come, nice. come kick it, come kick it with us. Sounds good. Hey, can you guys do us a quick favor? Yes. Could you do a promo ID for our station to say your name, the band you're with? You're listening to Maximum Threshold, and throw some crazy out at the end of it. What's up, guys? This is Kyle from the American Fangs. You're listening to Maximum Threshold. Ooh, that was perfect, man. You have just listened to an exclusive interview on Maximum Threshold Radio. Thanks for listening and please visit us at MaximumThreshold.net.